is a bozo in regards to my warning that you planted the southern dining room too early. Do I look like a clown to you? Do I amuse you somehow? The last I looked, there was no Eric Day on the calendar. There is, however, a Groundhog's Day, a day set aside to commemorate the Groundhog's long history of meteorological expertise. So when I tell you you're playing Russian roulette with precious seedlings, I know what I'm talking about, as is evident by this April, wait for it, snowstorm. Now, as to the matter of the 6.73 cows, since your unsophisticated palate is unable to discern the superior taste of vegetables grown in cow manure, I can see why obtaining 6.73 cows might not be a priority. And while I feel growing the best tasting vegetables is the top priority, I also realize that caring for my vegetables and 6.73 cows may be beyond your limited abilities. I will do my utmost best to enjoy the substandard vegetables you'll be growing this season. And finally, there's the matter of the spinach you planted in Sector C1. Your point about the spinach being for you is well taken. After all, I can hardly expect you to slave away on my vegetables without allowing you to share in a bit of the bounty. But Eric, at your age, shouldn't you be watching your cholesterol? After all, if something unspeakable were to happen, who would tend my dining rooms? Perhaps you might reconsider the spinach in favor of some more of that delectable Swiss chard you planted last season. Now run along, Eric. You'll need to get some blankets on those tender young plants if you have any hope of saving them. Can I stop sprinkling these potato flakes now? 